Peperomia dolebriformis, agroplants.org. This subfrem succulent, also known as prayer Peperomia, uh, it's perennial evergreen used for ornamental plant, uh, mostly for the leaves, uh, uh, and can be a uh, growing variety of climate, tropical, Mediterranean, subtropical, or as a indoor or indoor as a house plant. Uh, if you would like to uh, to grow it, there is a link below. Link in the right top side. And if you purchase, this is donation for this channel. Also, another amazing donation don't forget to subscribe it really helped me to continue and create more videos a uh, growing hard in a zone of 10b and uh, the flowers are white not very uh, it's like an ice pop shape the leaves it's a beautiful part at least in my opinion uh, in order to grow it you will need uh, how to grow it so well-drained soil moist soil better more than 16 celsius degree it's been 60 fahrenheit Optimal temperature will be from 18 to 26 uh, Celsius. It's been 64 to 80 Fahrenheit, uh, but can survive above uh, 5 Celsius. It's been 41 Fahrenheit. And better to use rainwater or clean water. It's uh, better in uh, rich soil, high humidity, and pH uh, 6 and a little bit lower. Uh, usually for carrying this plant you need to add fertilizer at least once a year keep the soil moist but with well drained and prune once a year if you need to prune something uh, you can start to grow it by plant seeds or just cutting uh, you can propagate by leaves or stem if you choose to do to use cuttings uh, you should better cut it or just to take the leaves with your hand and Take care not to break it. Wait for a few days in the shade until the tissue will heal. The moment that it's healed, uh, take another day or so and just put it in the soil and treat it the same condition as you give to fully mature plant. Uh, it's better to start by cutting. It's easier than starting by seeds. Uh, just easier. Uh, planting season will be spring and hard in a zone of uh, 10B. Uh, spring to summer in hardiness zone of 11 and all the year can be uh, in hardiness zone of 12 plus major pests are aphids mealybugs mites or white fly pouring season can be all the year uh, usually it's dead leaves and bloom stems height of the plant it's 10 centimeter to 25 it's been 4 to 10 inches uh, the bloom stem it's a high part of the plant uh, the plant itself are smaller, like more into 10 cm. Uh, this plant is a gr slow growing plant that requires small amount of water, uh, but keep it moist, lightly moist, and do not over water. Better to use rainwater or clean water. Light condition, it's full shade with a lot of light, it's important for the plant. And this is why you can grow it indoor, but if you don't have enough light, it might cause some... Uh, soft softer leaves and it will kill the plant slowly slowly uh, when you want to grow it in a container need to check that uh, the plant uh, will be affected by dry dry air uh, from warmer eaters and cooling machine uh, and this is a problem for the plant you can grow it in a container there isn't uh, take a small pots like can be even five uh, liters this is the really smallest but uh, i think better uh, depends the size of the plant better 30 to 50 percent bigger than the root ball need to switch uh, the soil once in a few years uh, better to do it in the winter usually uh, wash the soil from the roots cut uh, some roots the dead ones and maybe consider to prune the plants use a potting mix with a peat soil or just a cactus mix even it's possible uh, no cactus mix it's a bad idea don't use it uh, almost organic matter and chop mulch better to put the mulch uh, it keeps the soil moist uh, also peat soil it's very good if you use perlite it's cause uh, the ph will go up uh, so use small amount of perlite just for the good drainage uh, blooming season can be from the spring to the summer white flowers uh, grow on the stems 
if you want to grow it from seeds so it is possible to grow it from seeds uh, peat soil better sterile uh, ph of six moist soil high humidity uh, put it in a plastic bag or something like this or just a greenhouse temperature around 25 celsius degrees it means 77 fahrenheit and better in the night 22 celsius 68 fahrenheit with a lot of light it's also important Except this uh, dry and dark location, this is the way it's sorry to keep the seeds before. Planting season will be the best in the spring, but possible also in the summer and the autumn. Uh, better to, to plant it in a closed box, like a, you know, take a plastic box and just keep it there. Uh, make some holes and open it once in a day or twice in a day better. Planting spacing, a separate pot will be better, or 2 on 3 cm, so it means 1 on 1.5 inches. And better to put it on the soil, don't cover it, and if you choose to cover it, very very lightly. And it will usually germinate after 4 to 8 weeks, and don't forget that the seedlings are very fragile and require high humidity. Except this easy plant to grow, but as a house plant, it's not hard to grow. Doesn't require much. I know it sounds a lot, but uh, this is. Uh, it's not in the end of the day when you need to grow it. It's not a lot uh, to care for this plant, and it's beautiful leaf. So if you choose to grow it for the leaf, this is the reason the flowers are okay. That's all from GrowPlants.org. Don't forget to subscribe, visit our website, and of course, if you have any question, just ask. You have here links about more videos, some list, subscribe, and of course purchase a plant and this is donation for our channel. I hope you enjoy and come visit us again.